As you know, you know, Media Ocean has a legacy in traditional linear television that has now spanned 51 years through Donovan Data Systems. Um, so our heritage is deep rooted. Um, at the end of the day, when you strip it all out, uh, we are a traditional media buying platform for agencies that come with a lot of that back office. But our heritage really is in, is in television. So what we are most excited about is leading the charge, going from kind of linear to multi-screen, programmatic, connected TV. Uh, and it's been exciting. So, you know, I think convergence, a lot of people think about the buying differences on convergence. We look at convergence as a, not necessarily a buying problem, but a planning and measurement problem. Uh, and so we're now focused on building our solutions there, both internally and through partnerships uh, like 4C, VideoAmp, and, and 2Mobile. This August will be three years where we sold the company to a private equity firm. Um, and in the past three years, we have made six acquisitions, which has diversified our, you know, not only our product portfolio, but we've expanded globally. We've expanded our presence. Um, whereas our business used to be 90% ad agencies, we're now selling direct to CMOs on a planning workflow solution called Lumina. Uh, we're now selling direct to TV broadcasters and, and publishers uh, through Prisma for Sellers. And, uh, and we're excited because as, as that, you know, kind of upfront future buys moves into spot and spot moves into digital and within digital programmatic in real time and all audience based, you know, planning and buying need to come together and buying and selling need to come together. So, so we think that's the solution that the industry needs, thus MediaOcean is focused on it. In the case of companies like 4C, uh, they have done an amazing job at being, of creating platforms that where you can plan, buy, measure, and optimize all in one system through advanced data, through AI, through machine learning, and the tricky part is being able to respect um, what makes TV the most efficient media marketplace in the world today and continues to be um, while moving it into the digital future. So, uh, so we've been very selective on the companies we partner with because you need to respect the way television has been bought and sold and the economics of television. If all we do as an industry is make television look like digital programmatic today and the mess of the supply chain that exists out there, then we will fail. We need to, we need to keep the economics of TV today and, and leverage you know, the, 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 the targeting and the data available for digital, but we need to do it efficiently or else both advertisers, agencies, and publishers, TV broadcasters all fail. And Bill, we're getting near the uh, upfront, and I was wondering, mm -hmm. you know, your thoughts about this whole discussion of audience buying versus agent demo, how that might make, how what your own perspective on the industry is, mm -hmm. and perhaps uh, how it might impact your business. Sure. Uh, well, it's going to impact all businesses. Um, you know, the what Nielsen has been able to do is create a currency that everyone agrees on, that is easy to measure. Um, and they can do it at scale with a level of stability that nobody else has. I think Nielsen has done a really, really good job of expanding um, you know, their data sets uh, to be more relevant in the digital age. And in the past three years, I think they've done a really good job. Um, but what the market really wants is an alternative. Um, Comscore, despite their troubles of measuring their own revenue, has actually created a nice viable alternative for the marketplace. But what we're seeing now is the MVPDs, who are very, very concerned about the likes of Google and Facebook, um, now ha sitting on you know, really good set-top box data, really good audience data, uh, and a lot of them are leaning in to platforms like, like 4C and VideoAmp um, and, and potentially 2Mogul uh, to provide that set-top box data. And what we're seeing is the market is almost open to there being another player uh, in that space, and TV buyers are now willing to buy on impressions and audience demos and not necessarily rely only on the GRP. Um, and now we're also seeing companies like Oracle uh, enter the fray with their acquisitions of data logics and Moat kind of getting into the measurement space. So I think the next few years, as it relates to measurement, is going to be very interesting to watch. And, and it's one of the things, you know, Media Ocean is a neutral and open platform. So, uh, so we will evolve as the industry evolves. And if, you know, we've done a lot of work with Comscore over the last two and a half, three years uh, to integrate them in to be ready for next year's upfronts. But if, if a third, fourth, and fifth player emerges, we will work with them 
to provide solutions for the industry.